Welcome back, fans. This is Tiffany Hegebo here with your daily soap opera spoilers. Although their predicament seems pretty close to hopeless, Abby manages to maintain a somewhat optimistic outlook, assuring Scott that they will be found. She may be more right than she knows, as Paul makes clear when he tells Sharon that he has a lead. While much of Genoa City is focused on the hunt, Kane is occupied with his own concerns, and he ultimately accepts some comfort from Hillary. The game is afoot, and the chase will soon be on. While we wait to watch, here's some soap opera news to help fill the time. Everyone loves a good redemption story, particularly if it shows how a given character can grow beyond their distasteful beginnings. At times, though, we have to wonder if certain soap opera villains, or even just fallen heroes, should stay beneath the grace of goodness, either for the benefit of the story or just because it makes the most sense. According to 36% of survey viewers, bad guys and bad girls should stay precisely that, bad. Either their actions can't be forgiven, or their personalities aren't exactly the sort that would welcome a positive change. On the other hand, 64% of fans said that anyone can be redeemed, and that the stories of how they do it are often the most compelling. Either way, the struggle between good and evil has long been a staple of daytime drama, and it's often most interesting when that clash happens inside a single person. Don't leave just yet, fans. As you may be aware, we've been offering secret codes which you can enter at SoapHub.com 5000 for chances to win $5,000. Well, we have another one for you today. In just a second, that code will appear on your screen and you can use it for even more bonus entries. Are you ready? Here it is. Today's secret code is FEAST. Head over to SoapHub.com 5000 and type it in now. There's also a link beneath this video. Until next time, thanks so much for watching. I'm Tiffany Hegebo, and I'll see you again soon.